Okay, guys, so I took one of these wine glasses. I'm going to do another DIY with it. And then I'm going to take my high glue and I'm, we're going to attach it the same way we did the other one. Just go ahead and place it on top and attach it into place. But this one we're going to do a little bit different. I'm going to put some high glue on top um, all the way around. And once you put it, you're going to put one of these little round floral foam and place it on top. But first, you could also put one of these tea lights. Um, you couldn't see it as much, but you decide if you want to do it or not. Then just go ahead and do the same process that I did and put um, hot glue and attach the floor foam on top. Then after that, you're going to go ahead and grab your flowers. I took a toothpick, put it inside my flower, and then I'm going to go ahead and place it in the floor foam like that so i'm going to continue doing this putting different colors of flowers um all the way around it until you do the whole thing and then i took this um little glass they have in dollar dress swap well, put some hot glue and then attach it to the floral foam just like that hold it into place and then i put my candle inside um for this candle it will be on top so just press it and then i got for the next year why i'm gonna grab one of these little wine glasses a, a short version one you could do any size that you would like i just wanted to make it a little bit smaller smaller then cut some floral foam into a little piece like that so you could put it on top put some hot glue and then you're gonna attach it to the glass like that then go ahead and do the same process put flour all the way around it then after you do the whole thing all the way around it i took one of this um, little small glass container and then i'm gonna place it on top and then just put more flowers to the top and this is how cute you guys it turns out this is how the first diy which i think it came out so cute and it's so simple you don't have to spray paint you can also spray paint it but i'm just showing you this idea where you could just do it like this and it's not that expensive now let me show you the smaller version which is this one right here which i think it came out super cute as well you can put both of them together in the same table so that's why i did it and let me show you that's how it turns out which is i think super cute and super easy for you guys to do it um now you can also do it in silver you could color in gold whatever color that you were doing and this one how it was turns out as well now for the next diy i'm gonna grab one of these glass i'm, I'm gonna put it upside down like that and then i'm gonna go ahead and grab my hot glue and put some hot glue all the way around it and then i'm gonna take the same um round floor foam that i have with the flowers and just place it on top then i'm gonna take my other glass and place it on top as well and this is how cute you guys it turns out this is simple and easy for you guys to do now for the next year where i'm gonna take the um the glass out and then i'm gonna put one of these candle holders repainted in gold i'm gonna put some hot glue all the way around it and then i'm gonna put the glass on top like that to attach it and then i'm gonna take these two candle holder and place it side by side you could do one or two it's up to you another way that you guys can do it is this light i just grabbed this light from dollar tree i'm gonna turn it on and if you're going to do this you have to make sure that you do it the day of the birthday party because you won't be able to turn it on and off um the same day then go ahead and place your candle and this is how cute you guys it turns out this is how it look with the two candle and then this is how it look with one candle you decide which one you want to do it with a candle to candle and this one without the candle thanks again for watching special creations by nelly comment down below let me know which one is your favorite